Hey yo, what is up guys? My video today, I am a car X and I'm going to be showing you the steering wheel tune for the last print, aka the R32 Skylight. Okay, so the body cut I wrote is the R&T, because uh, I wasn't sure why the RJ to go know that. I think this looks really sick how it is, personally. Um, but yeah, let's get on to the tune. You guys have to, uh, like, I'll go through it slowly, but you can also pause it if you need to. Okay, I'm not going to go out with them all because that's how long, but... <sighs> You get me? Ow, I just headbutted my microphone. You guys can just pause this whenever you want. Um, I'll just flick through it quicker. So you guys can kind of like, pause it whenever. I'll just take my time with it. Uh, you kind of got to copy everything for it to even work, so. If I was you, I would just copy this. There you go. Done. Uh, okay, let's hop into a quick room and we will, well I will show you how this thing drifts. Okay, this thing does go very angled, but it's quite forgiving. It's like, in the fact, you won't lose your drift. Like, I don't care about those points up top, to be honest with you. I never really have, because guess not what this game is generally about. Like, it's this is like about how you would drift in real life, you know? Okay, this thing's really smooth. Like, I had them 360s in it before. I did it like my previous attempted recording, but it was a 30 second recording by mistake. And I didn't capture it. So, I'm going to do that. It's quite heavy on the steering, but that's fine. Okay, I'm going to do that. Pop my pan. Attempted 360 totally. Like, I'm not a pro by all means, but this car is so much easier to drift and some people struggle with like genuinely attempting to like even drift in this game and um, it's just down to your car sometimes you can have five hours plus on one car and still not be good at it because of the tune you have on it or because you haven't tuned it you get me like this is, it is really good okay i need to focus a bit more because i am not drifting too well it's just what we use in drifting This car is straight to slides if you don't like accelerate for long enough. If that makes sense to some of you. There we go. See, it's nice and slow, but it's also nice and smooth at the same time. So it's like a really good combo once you get used to it. Like I'm only semi getting used to it now. Like, I'm used to using like other cars. Like uh, I use a lot of the C6 Corvette because it's really fast, but it's really fast and it spins out a lot because of the power. That's some more of us advanced drivers. And I'm not really an advanced driver, so, you know. It is really good though. I'll go down to this little main area and you can kind of watch how it drifts. No, yep, that's better to do a ultimate wall tap, you know. Okay, let's just get back into the drift. Angle, way too much angle, angle. Who put that wall there? Like, who? Who decided that wall would be good there? Let's retry that. There we go. See what I mean? You can, you can slow it down and still carry on the drift. If you think about it. Okay, I did not even drift that corner there. Oh well. Let's just peek. Okay, let's just keep on going. Okay, nice and sideways. Nice and sideways. Nice and sideways. There we go. I'll, I'll attempt to 360 real quick. Fuck. Okay, I, I didn't like fully do it, but you can see you can do 360s. This car would be pretty good on a map like St. Petersburg or. Mm, or that city one. I can't remember what it's called, but. Yeah, but this car is pretty good as you can see. Like, it is a good car. Like, look, it can even drift us backwards, bro. See that? Wait, can you do a reverse into a drift? Okay, 
And you can. Okay, well, anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, this is the R32 Skyline. If you, if you want the build, you need to go back to the start of the video. It is really fun to drive. And it isn't too fast, so it's really good for beginners. Um, and also, before I end it, you guys probably should be using the general settings of, like, no assist and stuff. Because it will really help you. Um, and use 720, or, like, angle, twist turning it. And this, like, at the start. And then eventually go up to 900. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy watching. Uh, see you guys in another video, and peace out.